Hi, this is Pat Galanfi with Attention Central mm -hmm. Texas. Welcome. Today we have as our special guest Lauren Savell from the Colleen Healing Rooms. Welcome, Lauren. Good morning, Patsy. How are you? Good morning. I'm doing wonderful, and yeah. I know there's a lot going on at Colleen Healing Rooms. Before we get to that, can you tell us a little bit about what is Colleen Healing Rooms and what you guys do? Well, Colleen Healing Rooms started here in Colleen area in 2012. We opened up to pray for people for healing, anybody who needs any kind of healing, um, healing for body uh, pain, uh, we see pain be relieved very quickly when we pray. Um, relationship problems that need healing, um, emotional problems, mental health problems, as well as spiritual problems. And so people come to Colleen Healing Rooms on the second Saturday of the month, um, and that's going to be this weekend, Saturday, um, from 9.30 to 11.30, we offer prayer and um, then on the last Tuesday of the month, we offer prayer from 6.30 to 8. And um, people come here to the building here at KPLE. And we uh, are open for prayer during those times. And we've seen just some tremendous things happen. Um, lives changed, bodies healed, and people uh, able to just receive just an amazing um, powerful presence of God when they come in, and and they're just they're just blessed. They're just blessed, and um, it's just been a wonderful opportunity to serve the Colleen area. Amen. Amen. Well, I know um, I'm also part of the healing room teams, and I know it's it's just a blessing to to minister to those that come in. And there's so many hungry people out there that are just looking for somebody that will believe with them. Um, and so it's not only impacts them physically, it really impacts their soul. It, it, it gives them a new sense of faith and hope that they just didn't walk in with. And it's amazing to watch. Now, one of the things that Colleen Healing Room does, I know, is that they uh, regularly have um, a seminar for, the, for two reasons. One is to train people in working in the healing room or ministering in the healing room. But in, our, in addition to that, uh, the, the seminar is for those that just want to learn about healing and learn about how they can walk in that ministry outside the four walls of the church. So I know you guys have one coming up soon. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yes, I'd love to. Um, on March 24th, which is a Saturday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., we're doing a uh, a training called a, a seminar called Exploring Healing from a New Covenant Perspective. And what we mean by a new covenant perspective, Patsy, is that um, we look at the life of Jesus and the example that he gave us and also the things that he taught us in the word about healing. And so we follow along with the new covenant because that's what we fall under, under um, his grace, under the blood of Jesus, that he died on the cross for all of our healing, for our wholeness, for our wellness, for our salvation, for all of our spiritual understanding as well as for the healing of our bodies. And so we want people to have a new understanding that divine healing, what it looks like um, uh, because of what Jesus has done for us. And so it's just an amazing time of exploring the word in scriptures, the word in, um, we do some live teaching. I teach a class myself. And um, then we also have some recorded teachings during that time and um, and then there's a time of fellowship we uh, have we serve lunch to the people who are coming to the seminar and um, and then that's a time to just share uh, all the great stories about the things that have happened either through healing rooms or praying for people we we pray for people on the phone we go to hospitals sometimes and pray for people we've gone to nursing homes and we've prayed for people in their homes as well as when people come to our healing room um, opportunities here is there a cost for this seminar oh no the seminar is free awesome. um, and people are um, encouraged to we encourage you to sign up though because we need to know the numbers of people mm -hmm. that are coming so we make sure we have enough supplies and information and um, 
you know, you put together these wonderful packets of information that people can take home with them and study more about healing. And so um, we want to make sure we have all of that ready um, on that Saturday morning so that when people are coming, they, they, we have everything we right. need and we're yeah. ready to go. Yeah. Well, I know um, I've already done a little study in this area, so I know that if they do want to sign up, there's a couple of ways to do that. Um, the, you can go to the website at www.colleenhealingrooms.com, go to the contact page, send uh, your name, address, and phone number, and then you can also call 254-681-5823, and that will get you to our Colleen Healing Room person, and they will sign you up and get you registered, and it's going to be a really, really wonderful day. Um, I know that that you actually are a nurse uh, in the school system, right? Yes, ma'am. And uh, and you kind of, uh, I know y'all aren't allowed to talk about Jesus in public school, but I suspect that you've had opportunity to just because the, actually the Bible doesn't say pray for people; it says lay hands on them. So have you actually seen some things in the school system where you've had children come into that nurses area and you were able to just lay your hand on them even though you didn't pray out loud? Got any good testimonies? <laughs> well, of course, you know, every morning when we come into the building um, where, where we work, um, we pray um, about, you know, just that, that things will be, um, healing will happen. And of course, you know, I, I can take a temperature, um, I can um, uh, put band-aids on, which mm -hmm. is frequently happening. And, and then when, when students come in and they need um, comfort and care, we definitely can put our hands either on their hand or the part that's hurting. We put ice packs on, on parts mm -hmm. and, and we can definitely release God's healing power there over, their, over their lives and their bodies. Yeah. And it, it's, um, I see that when, um, when that is happening, that, that kids just are great, they can go back to class and there's, there's nothing keeping them back from what they need to do in learning yeah. at school. Yeah, and, and I, I like this, this whole studying the seminar is gonna lay a foundation for those of us that want to do that, not just in healing room, but in your workplace. In, right. Uh, uh, even in your church. You right. know, I, I tell people all the time, pastors, if you have ministry team leaders that you stand up in front of that church and you uh, have ministry team leaders praying for the sick, let them come to the seminar. Let mm -hmm. them build that foundation and mm -hmm. they'll really understand better that when they lay their hands and they'll have the faith to believe that you're going to mm -hmm. see more miracles even in your church. Mm -hmm. So uh, we just thank you, Lauren. You're such, a, you're such a blessing. You're the director of this thing and you've been such a blessing over the years as we have, um, as we have just consistently had the doors open for the Colleen area. And, uh, and you've been a blessing to me and I just want to thank you for that. Um, and, and one of the things that's been real, really cool with Colleen Healing Rooms is, like, I, like she mentioned, we actually do um, have the doors open here at the KPLE um, uh, building. And they have been so gracious to, to help us do that. And the important thing is that this wonderful ministry called KPLE um, needs to stay open. And so today I just want to encourage all of you, if you can become part of that Gideon's Army that we've been talking about, I want to encourage you to do that, whether you're a, a pastor or a ministry leader or just uh, somebody that doesn't think they even have a ministry. You have one. You have a ministry with your family. You have a f ministry with your friends. And when you consistently sow seed into a ministry like this, then you will consistently reap the benefits from the kingdom of God. And I want to encourage you to do that. Uh, for those of you that would like to become part of Gideon's Army, you can do that with a $25 a month uh, donation. Uh, that you can also have be part of Gideon's Torchbearers, which is $50 a month. The others that are available are $100 a month, $150 a month. You can become Gideon's Champions for $200. Are, and, and if the Lord uh, lays it on your heart, I encourage you to become a $250 a month partner with KPLE. It's going to be a seed planted in good soil. I can guarantee you. I've known uh, these people for decades. 
and this is good soil. They don't squander your money. Every penny that comes into this ministry is used for the kingdom of God. And if you would like to just give a one-time gift, um, uh, if you're a mugaholic like I am, if you open a cabinet in my kitchen, you will see a, that I am a mugaholic. I made sure I walked away today with a KPLE TV mug to add to my wonderful collection. And I know there are women out there that are mugaholics. So I just want to encourage you, uh, if you give a one-time $25 gift today, uh, you can ha have a mug or a tote bag, which is wonderful to take to Walmart uh, for a $10 donation. You take that tote bag to Walmart or Aldi's and really become part of your ministry because people will say, oh, that's a cool bag. So anything we have can become a ministry if you're, if you're, led, if you're led by the Holy Spirit. There's also a, a beautiful candle. If you uh, uh, would like that there for a one-time donation of $50, or you can get all three, the bag, the mug, the candle for a $100 one-time gift. So we encourage you, you can also donate online. Go to kpletv.org or you can call 554-3683. And uh, not only to donate, they have people ready to pray with you. If you need healing today, call that number 254-554-3683 and there, someone there will pray for you and believe with you for your healing, your health, your restoration. Uh, if you have family needs, these people know how to pray. And so, uh, and there's also a toll-free number of 877-640-5673. So I really encourage you. And, and one of my favorite things, I'm a cord cutter, meaning I have pretty much done away with my TV at home, but I'm able to watch many of these programs uh, on their website. Um, and uh, they're looking at new avenues right now to, in, to broaden uh, how they get this message out. Who, who knows, maybe we'll be seeing them on live Facebook soon. Uh, so, but in the meantime, they need money to do that, and I just encourage all of you, become a partner today. It's important, and, they w and you will be blessed, and I know you will be blessed by the Lord, and the kingdom of God will be made manifest in you and your family. So uh, we just thank you today, and we just uh, thank you, Lauren, for coming and sharing with us about the healing rooms and about the seminar. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being with us today.